Having defeated Shao Kahn, Reptile was feared by all. He forced Shang Tsung to regenerate his raptor race. The process took agonizing months, but soon Reptile heard the snarls of young broodlings throughout the flesh pits. Eventually, Shang Tsung had created an army of raptor warriors bred to serve Reptile. They stormed the realm, killing any Tarkatan, Shokan, or Centaur who opposed Reptile's rule. The intoxicating feeling of reuniting with his people blinded Reptile to the suffering of his former comrades. Reptile was home once more. After Shinnok's defeat, Reptile was ordered to Earthrealm by Kotal Khan to assess the damage. Such intel could prove useful in future conflicts. Stumbling upon a collapsed cavern, exposed during the crisis, Reptile was shocked to see raptors emerging from within. Unlike the rest of his race, these raptors had never left Earthrealm for the doomed realm of Zaterra, and thus had remained safe and hidden. Alone no more, Reptile vowed to remain with his rediscovered people and reclaim their Earthrealm homeland. Fleeing Outworld, I hadn't expected to return. But then I also hadn't expected the new Empress to make me an offer I couldn't refuse. To thank me for helping stop General Shao's rebellion, she asked me to be her emissary to the Zaterans. Going home. Bearing the seal of the royal house, I would show once and for all, that my mutation wasn't to be feared. But it wasn't a source of shame. To my surprise, I was welcomed. But those warm smiles hid a dark secret. I stumbled upon a trove of official records, which showed that my shape-shifting ability isn't unique. Many Zaterans are born with it, but are killed by their government to keep it from spreading. Who started this barbaric policy? Who is now enforcing it is unknown. But I will find out. And I will put an end to this madness. <laughs> 